Hello and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Legends Arceus Nuzlocke Challenge. In today's episode, uh, we're going to pick up right where we left off last time and uh, continue trying to get Sneasler, I suppose. That's our next thing. I forget if I have to fight him or not. Uh, ooh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to ride Ursaluna because we may as well try and, you know, get some stuff, right? Um... I did, in case you're wondering, add stone to the team, our Geibel. Uh, <laughs> we're getting, it's possible I should have benched lasagna for the moment, but I'll, I mean, lasagna's still getting experience, I guess. I can't use lasagna, because it's over level 50. I can't really use stone, because it's level 23, which means, really, we're confined to Mercury, Louisa, Nice, and Rotera. And if we're being real, Mercury's getting a little too strong. Like, we cannot use mercury if it gets past level 50. So if we get to level 50, we need to go deposit mercury so we don't over level ourselves out of being able to fight electrode because we definitely want mercury for that fight. Um, that's the big thing we need to be aware of. Uh, otherwise we got big bear. I want to say, did we not actually end up catching anything? When we were up there last time, I don't think we caught anything down here. So maybe if there's something fun in the rain, maybe something fun in the water. Wouldn't it be crazy if I just died right there? That'd be pretty embarrassing, huh? Can we jump it? Oh, uh, yeah. Well, we sort of can. Can you go inside this waterfall? No. Boy, there are not enough secret waterfall locations in here, y'all. That's what I am saying. There should be secret waterfall caves. I guess there's that thing. I feel compelled to collect these things, even though we can't realistically consider catching all of them. That'd be ridiculous. When I see them, I'm just like, we, I, we pretty much have to get it, right? That's the rules of playing a game like this. Well, nothing but gold bats around here, no fun. So we have caught 11 things in this area as well, worth noting. Um, especially just because we want to catch at least 20 things to get that particular kind of bonus when we do our research tasks. So that's good to know. Ursaluna is smelling something. What is it? What is it? What is it, girl? All right, just, just forget it though. Yeah, we're just gonna head through the cave, I suppose. Haven't caught anything yet. Oh, there's something in there? That's weird. It's like, it's sending you into the cave, but you can't. May as well grab that iron chunk. We didn't go this way last time, so we'll go this way this time. We're just gonna get lost in here, why not? Ah, yes, glorious. All right, we're pretty much just trying to get back to where we were last time, but I guess we can kind of surf around some in here if we want. We caught the guy in the cave, so we don't really catch that bar boach. Um, we could look around, though. I suppose. Well, we could catch it for the sake of... Um, for the sake of the Pokedex, right? Where'd it go? Is it using Splash? Oh, just don't run right there. Oh, okay, we don't want to go there. Alpha Crobat attack, that'd be bad. Oh, there's a Wish Cache. How about you don't, dude? Yeah, you want to fight, you tiny catfish? You're going down, man. I don't even care if you die now. Stop. Oh my gosh, Rotera looks so good. The yellow on the Umbreon looks so good in this game. I cannot believe it. I, ca I cannot believe how much I'm enjoying it. What a color. What a color. Ursaluna, you need to find something, man. We've been running around on this bear. Speaking of Ursaluna, I believe there's some Ursa ring up in these pot. Ooh, ooh, okay. That looks extremely catchable and extremely unawares. As ever, the Psyduck. Turn around. Turn around, Psyduck. Bam! Getting the ball, getting the ball. Yeah, we got it. First one caught, so that's nice. New species registered. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I meant to throw this. Number of heavy specimens. Look at that. Just out of the gate, we immediately get two research tasks for that as well. 
And the question is, can we go get the gold duck as well? Stay in the grass, stay in the grass, stay in the grass. Don't be seen, don't be seen, don't be seen. Be a sneaky little person, be a sneaky. Gonna catch a duck, gonna catch a duck, gonna catch a duck. Gonna catch a duck with its back turned to us. Bam! Ducks go in balls. In this case, normally they go in cups, but in today's episode, they go in the Pokeball. Caught ourselves a duck. Caught ourselves a duck. What? Question is, can we catch ourselves another duck? Because I saw another one over there. Oh, yeah. we got. Oh, it's sleeping, too. Oh, we are going to catch a sleeping duck. Be very sneaky. Be very quiet. We're going to get it. Boom. Backstrike on the sleeping gold duck. Do it. Get in the ball, gold duck. But bam you'll love to see it. That's three catches on the day. Woo! Oh! Oh! Oh, what? What? Do y'all see what I see? Stone can evolve. Let's do it. Do it now! <laughs> Alright. Just like that. Just like that. We have the Gabite. Oh, big dragon. I love the evolution in this game. They give them those yellow eyes that look like so menacing. Almost no matter what it is. Yes, Gabite! That is what is up. Do you have new moves? No. I have new, more powerful moves. Number caught. Man, look at that. That's... We've gotten like five research tasks done. We are crushing it this episode. And we evolved our dragon Pokemon! Now we're gonna catch that Parasect. It is going... It is going... Oh, we're gonna catch a Mushroom! Let's get a Mushroom. Let's get a Mushroom. It is asleep. It is... No! Not you. No. You. No! Sleeping Mushroom! Sleeping Mushroom Shrike! Double catch. Double catch. Go, go, go. Catch him, catch him. Bam! Man, we are on fire! Number caught. We need to catch another Paris. That'll be another research task, y'all. Can we catch this duck? <gasps> he looks like a sneaky duck. Sneaky duck, sneaky duck, sneaky duck. Sneaking up on Sneaky Duck. Turn around, Duck. Oh yeah, you got nothing, you got it. Oh, you're going down. Oh, you're going down. <gasps> yes, backstrike, get it, get it. We're catching our way across this field. Bam! Go. I'm so, I'm having so much fun catching stuff. We can't use any of the stuff we've caught this episode at all. It's all getting released. But it's helping us advance in the game. It's helping us make sure we can use Mercury. Huh. Also, you may notice, I'm still walking. I'm actually recording this right after the last episode. So, if you recall, is it like 16,000 steps? Make your guesses for how many steps I'll be at at the end of this episode. Hmm? Hmm? Maybe we'll break 20,000. That'd be awesome. Side goal for the episode, Jay breaks 20,000 steps on the day. Which, by the way, in case you're wondering, you have no idea what I'm talking about. Uh, we have a step competition happening in our Discord server right now. You can join teams. You can join air, water, earth, or the team that I am on fire which is the one you should join if you want to join. Patreon.com slash SuperCarlinGaming. It's super fun. Oh, oh, you think you're some big hotshot, eh, Parasect? I don't think, oh, 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 he thinks he's sneaky. We should get, we should do this. We're clearly making too much noise. You don't even have eyes, dude. Yes, turn your hollow back. Boom! Backstrike! Oh, is the Get it, get it, get it. No! Ah, oh, butts. Okay. Never mind. Our fun is over. Maybe not. Maybe. Oh! Oh! It'd be like that, do it! Alright, time to fight. Time to fight, Parasect! You're about to get snarled at. Or better yet, maybe you're about to get dark pulsed. Boom, hit him with the old Dark Pulse. Oh, it didn't kill him. Venoshock. How dare you. All right. Well, we could probably just catch it, honestly, right? Which we may as well do. I think that's the better move. <laughs> Go for it. Yeah, you been caught, Parasect. You thought you could, uh, thought you should get away. But you couldn't. Let us catch a mushroom. Now we caught a mushroom. Times you've seen it use Vanishock? Look at that, just like that. We have yet another glorious research task complete. Boom! Getting the ball. There's no way that's not caught, right? Paris, 
Bam. Four for four. Research task. Ball of mud. We almost definitely caught more than... That's nine things, right? Have we caught nine things this episode? I can't remember. We can feather ball that thing. That's for sure. Turn around, Motham. I love the feather balls. They just travel in, like, in a completely direct straight line. Bam! You can throw them so far. Look at that! Research task. Stantler. Oh! 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 Oh yeah, we were using the berries on the Stantler last time, weren't we? That was effective. If I recall. Yes, eat the berry, Stantler. Nothing suspicious about that berry! <laughs> there is something suspicious. It was a trap! Now you've been captured. It's so much more fun to play the game this way. I can't even, I can't even believe it. Oh, look, we've caught almost literally everything we've run across thus far in this episode. And I don't see why that has to change. Just because we're coming up on this parasect, yep. This is how we're going to get to keep using Mercury. Oh no! Ah! No! We missed! Butts. <gasps> but the Heracross is sleeping. That's the one we caught last time. Part of me doesn't want to use the... <laughs> doesn't want to use Mercury to catch this thing because I don't want to level up. I don't want to have to go... <laughs> um deal with being over level 50. I guess we could still get up, as long as we don't get above 50. Okay, don't look up. Oh, the Heracross woke up. Oh, man. Never mind. Now we're not going to catch it. We're just going to go this way. Get our feather ball ready, because if I recall, there's a Motham up here we can catch. I know we sort of did this part of the um, route yesterday or in the last episode, but we're just getting back to where we were. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. I want to backstrike you, dude. You're going down. Are you asleep? I think it was asleep. It was sleeping in midair. That's impressive. Ah! So it doesn't see us, though. Or does it? No. It's thinking about seeing us. Just turn around. You don't see us. Nothing to see. Nothing to see at all. We are just an innocent, pink-haired person in the in the grass. Totally natural. No, oh, no, no! Turn around. Come on. You do it. Yes. Oh man, there's a big moth from over there. Don't you? Don't talk, 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 talk. No reason to go talk to big moth. Oh crap. Just catch it. Catch it anyway. Yes! Alright, can we make more of those? We might need to, because we don't have any more feather balls. Craft feather ball. Oh yeah, we can make a lot more. We can make like... 24 more. Super! May as well, right? Let's go over here and catch this one too, because that'll be a research task. And hey, maybe we'll get up to like 30 Pokemon caught, then we'll really be moving. Bam! Backstrike! You did. That's totally caught. Right? No, it wasn't! Okay, man, that's a butt. Bummer. Alright, whatever. We're just moving on. Moving on. Greener pastures. New things to catch over here. Oh yeah, there's the bronze ores in here. Maybe we should get off our big bear. Because I guess we can catch these things if we're sneaky enough. That'd be good. Just turn around, Bronzor. Nope. Oh man. Forget it. Not that invested in it. If I can sneak up on him, that's one thing. If I have to, I have to go through all these battles. That's a whole different problem. I'm on a big bear. Don't attack me. That would be rude. All right, new area. So if we catch something in here, like that bear down there, probably. Oh boy. Ursaluna Ursa Ring. Ursaluna Ursa Ring. Okay, can we get it with the leaden ball? That guy is. Oh, he looks so dangerous. We're gonna have to try it. Uh, you know what I bet he likes? The dazzling honey. 
You know, he's a bear, right? Bears love honey. I bet if we can get this guy distracted with some dazzling honey, oh, Sonorous Path. Lovely, lovely. I bet we can get him no problem. Can it be done? Can it be done? Oh, he looks sneaky. He doesn't look sneaky, he just looks like... Oh, man. Oh, oh, oh boy. It looks dangerous is what he looks. Oh, boy. So, go over there. Seems like he'd have pretty good eyesight on us there, right? Oh, what, he doesn't want the honey? Is that a joke? I am surprised. Does he like that kind of berry? Eat it, yes, yes, eat, 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 eat. Boom! Oh my gosh, please get it. Run, 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 hide. Oh, we got it! Yo, we can use that! That's a level 40 Ursa Ring, yo! And an achievement, and a new Pokemon, so that's a win all around. One shot, one kill! Oh my gosh, that was awesome. That was awesome. Remember when we spent an entire episode trying to catch an alpha? Me too! Okay, let's go. What worked? What worked that time? It was the citrus berry? Okay, okay. We're gonna get another one. Maybe we'll catch all of them. We will catch all of the bears. All of the bears shall be out wares. Hmm? That's a, that's a rhyme. Totally. It totally works. Don't worry about it. Okay, he has to come over here and then kind of like turn around. Come on, bear. Bring it. I think we definitely probably want to backstrike them again though. That was, I think that was a key part of it. Oh, are you, are you sitting? Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. But like, oh, he's, that one over there is making me nervous. But like, go to sleep, man. That'd be great. If you just chilled, maybe I'll distract you with that one. Oh, that did not go as far as I wanted it to. Okay, we're going to have to be... Real sneaky, okay, real quiet. Real quiet, get back here, okay. Okay, okay, go over here, come on. Boom, yes! Come on, get him, get him! Oh, we got it, too! Yeah, oh, we're so good at this game. Oh, we are so good. Oh, that one's trickier, because he's got the little one with him. He's got the little one, that doesn't mean we can't get him. Doesn't mean we can't get him. Just chill, little Ursaluna. Little, little tiny bear. Oh no, it moved! Oh no! Ah! Teddy Ursa. We missed that one. Oh boy, he's coming for us. Oh, he looks mad. He looks angry. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh boy. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Don't worry about it, big bear. Is he still behind us? Oh, he's behind us. I don't... Oh, he looks mad. He looks angry. Let's, uh... Let's do this. Mm -hmm. We caught so many. We caught three. That was pretty good. Oh no, it's that dude. It's Volo. We're gonna have to fight him now? I am not in the mood, bro. Not in the mood. Got to do something to get this camp set up. Are you Volo or are you not? Oh no, you're a different person to set a camp up. Yay, then we, oh man, I, last time I should have come down the hill and we could have set the camp up. Not much progress was made since that Bronzor is getting in the way. It's not belligerent, but it seems like it wants something. So we just can't ignore it either. Can't we? Please, do you think you could find out what it, what it wants? Setting up the mountain camp, okay. Uh... All right, does it want to be captured? Hello, Bronzor. Zor! Oh, do I have to go find that one? Something over that way? Yeah, it looks like it. All right, it's up to me to save the day as usual. Duck! Ah, it's all us! Oh man, I was gonna try and catch it. I keep it in the wrong buttons, you guys. That's how you can tell I'm super good at this. All right, we'll just knock it out instead. Thunderfang! 
Oh no, now we're gonna level up though, aren't we? Oh no. Oh no, we're level 50 indeed. Okay, so if we do it again. Did you? Don't you, don't you even look at me, duck. Don't, nothing to see here. Regular pink haired person. Yep, catch it. Count it, count it. Did we get it or not? Zor, 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 zor. Is that all you had to do? What in the? That bronze or it's wounded. This is no good at all. I'll fix it right up. Ah! That should do it. Fit as a fiddle. Zor, zor. It was Bronzor at the new campsite. Was looking for its friend. All right. Here we go. Yes, let's go to the base camp. A new base camp, yay! Oh, it got out. Oh, man. Wait, where's the camp? There it is. Okay, super duper. Fish jump! Alright, Laventon. What am I at here? 25! No, okay, we're gonna catch five more and then we'll come do this and see how close we are to leveling up. That would be, I think, the most splendid. Most splendid indeed. Because you're up to level 27, so we've gotten a few levels this episode. That's fantastic. We should go ahead and let you do the things. All right, you should collect stuff so you can get extra EXP. Okay, there's nothing over there. Nothing over there. Nothing to see. All right. Bronzors. Let's go. Well, that was a terrible throw. There you go. XP. It's like free experience just for like throwing your football and stuff. Like I could just go pick that up. Does he, do you get experience for that or does it have to be stuff you'd have to otherwise? Okay. So easy. Am I gonna have to fight you, man? I don't really want to. Okay, here we go. Oh! You would never expect to be able to climb such sheer cliffs as these, yes? I mean, I don't know. But with Sneasler as an ally, it becomes the work of a moment. She is so at home on a cliff face, one might think she knew some secrets, some hidden move. <laughs> like rock climb! What am I saying? Hidden moves? There ah, are no such things in history, surely. Hmm. And I feel as though I was on the cusp of remembering something just now. <laughs> That's so funny. Just who was I before I came to history? Hmm. If you fell from the sky, you come from another world altogether, most likely. Perhaps a Pokemon battle will jog the memory loose. Oh, no. Would you honor me? Uh, all right. Yeah, all right. Maybe I should have switched my team around to put Luis up front so I could pff, ice punch whatever he's got. All aboard, man! Machoke, prepare for departure! All right, he's got a Machoke. That's not what I thought. I thought he would have dragon types. Warden Ingo challenge you to a battle. You got three Pokemon. Oh, boy. All right, so we don't want to use out nice on this. Mercury might not be the best matchup here. We don't really have a good, like, flying type attacker here, though, do we? Um, let's see. Do we have any obvious? I mean, we could try and Thunder Wave it. That's one thing for sure. We get to go first. Lisa, you're weak. Oh, boy, we do not have a good fighting matchup, do we? All right, we might have to stick with... Oh, I'm not trying to run. Are you crazy? All right, let's go Thunder Wave, right? Always a safe bet. Always good to paralyze your opponents. Maybe unable to move. Yes, that's right, fool. Now you're, now you're dead. Mm-hmm, I like to see it. Bulk up, not gonna matter. Offensive stats are raised, defensive stats are raised. I think we're still gonna take it out, even with a defensive buff. Yeah, it's gone, all right. Got through that one, no problem. Let's see what's next. High score. Oh. Flying ground. Mud bomb. Oh no, that's bad. I'm scared. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, so we're definitely gonna switch to Luisa. Yes, because this is a bad. Okay. We can hit him with some water type moves though. That'll still work. Alright. Yeah, let's go. Um. One shot, one kill. Let's do it. Boom. Luisa. Ten.
Angela? Well, that is a surprising. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Okay. So the good news is we can just switch right back out. Mercury's taking some damage, but I think we can still switch out here. And just hit it with Fire Fang, and that should do it. But I'm gonna have Tang growth at some point. Maybe we should try and get Mercury to master Fire Fang since we use it so much. Okay, it's burned. That should honestly kill it. Energy Ball, that shouldn't do much. Oh! See what I mean? Like, it shouldn't do much, but it did. Ugh. Don't like the look of that one bit. It's okay, Mercury got it. Mercury is the champion, as usual. Bravo, excellent. Look at, look at it, look at all rock, stone now. Who's was called him rock. <laughs> Stone, level 28. Your town has brought you to the destination called Victory! Now allow me to call Sneasler. Okay, so I thought I was gonna have to fight Sneasler. I kind of wish each of the different Pokemon had like a different flute sound. They're all the exact same. It's kind of like, they all respond to the exact same thing. Where's the Sneasler? Look at her little Shinx hat. Oh, little mask. That's so cool. I love it. <gasps> there it is, Sneasler. Man, I feel like if they just didn't put that weird dark star pattern thing on its face. It would have looked really cool. It just looks like it finished eating a very messy blueberry pie or something. <laughs> I do not like the look of Sneasler. Ugh. I can't do it. I'm not actually doing anything with my hand. It just like mentally put me in the right spot. This is, this, oh, okay, no. That little ear tail thing isn't actually glowing, it's just sort of toxic plate. Mmm. I'm afraid this is my final stop. Please proceed up the cliffs with Sneezer's aid and quell the Lord up in the mountains. I'll return to Jubilee Village. Please convey my well wishes to Warden Melly. Yeah. Warden Melly. The least favorite character in this game. Yay! Yeah, this is actually an extremely useful thing. It reminds me a lot of Breath of the Wild, where you just suddenly, like, ha! <laughs> Like, uh, let's go get it. Like, if you haven't seen it yet, it's just like, and hey, look, that's you in the back. That's me. Ha ha! Got some doppel bonnets. Lovely. Don't know what those are for, but we've got them. We just climb right up this cliff. Who knows? Clamber claw cliff. Oh, there's a Gliscor ourselves. Well, well, well. Or Gligar, as it were. Oh, would you see me? I don't believe you. First of all, we should go ahead and heal our boy. Our glorious champion, Mercury, right? Because Mercury took some damage in that fight, it has to be said. I'm not a fan of that. All right. You think you're going to fight me, man? I have news for you. I have a giant... Uh, weasel thing here and it's in fact going to destroy your brain yeah you're dead you man aqua tailed number defeated one so it'd be really great if we can catch one there's one i guess a feather ball should work on these things though right because it is a flying type maybe that'll work boom from such distance get it get it get it bam all right that is our First catch in this area, which means Clamberclaw Cliffs has been done. That's awesome. Is there another one? That was only one catch. We need four more catches, right? Before we can cash in our research points to see if we have increased the star level. Because otherwise, we're really going to have to bench Mercury. That's really what we're... Ooh, okay. I guess Ghastly's not flying type, right? So, yeah, no, it's not, obviously. Oh, boy. Well, here we go. Come on, Merc. We can just wreck this thing, though, no problem. We honestly should have sent out, um, not Mercury, but Rotera there, because that's our dark type, which would easily have wrecked that thing. Easily, easily weasily. Oh, a Magnezone, look at that thing. That looks dangerous. I don't think I've noticed that thing flying around up there before. <clears throat> hey, 
Hey, a guy ball. Yeah, wouldn't that have been fun? Um, I guess we could actually fight you, right? We actually have a type advantage and a level advantage. Yeah, go Stone! Agent Stone. Oh, a Haunter. Oh, that's new. Um. Haunter looks dangerous as well, though. Right? It doesn't mean we can't try and catch it. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, okay. It'd be like that. Oh, it'd be like that! What kind of food is a ghost like? Do you think it eats berries? Well, what do you know, guys? Write it down. Ghosts like bananas. Everyone knows it to be true. Oh, I didn't think we were going to catch it, but... Okay, okay, turn around. He can't see us. We used the opportunity to hide while he was in the Pokeball. Turn around. Turn around. Haunter. Just, just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Oh, that did not count as a back strike, unfortunately. Oh, we got it anyway! Bam! Is this a new, is this a new area? Are we in a new area? No, so we can't use that. We have to keep the Gligar and release the Haunter, but still counts as a new entry in the Pokedex. Nonetheless, that's exciting. Okay, okay. Maybe we'll go and catch this one too. Oh, maybe, but maybe not. Oh man, be real sneaky. Get in the grass, get in the grass. All right, that's what I like to see. Turn around. Oh boy. No chance, there's no chance. Maybe? No, I don't think so. Yeah, I didn't think so. Yeah, he's like, who was that? Hmm, who was that? Look at that Haunter. Haunter is such a cool design. I, don't, I mean, Haunter just looks way cooler than Gengar, I think. My, my personal opinion. Oh, where's he gonna pop up? Oh, ho! oh, ho! he's sneaky. Where'd he go? Or was he just completely gone? No, okay. Ah, oh, man. No, 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 no. Oh, come on! That was so much higher! All right, where's the bananas? We know this works. Right, I guess? Go eat the bananas. Go eat bananas. Come on, get in the ball. There you go, that's three. Number card of night, two. All right, research task. Count it. We need two more things. Oh, a guy ball. Hit it with a heavy ball. We need to distract it probably with some sort of food. I imagine. They really give you the guyables though, don't they? Moving in, moving in. Yeah, come on, get it, get it. Oh, that was awesome. We got it. Obviously, we can't keep it. Crunchy salt. Oh, crunchy salt. I bet they like crunchy salt. That's probably why they dropped it. We can discard this mud for crunchy salt. We can also use these items on stone. How about HP? And then attack. And then use on nice. Go for... HP, special defense, okay, making room, making room. All right, we need one more Pokemon and then we can go back to camp and see where we're at on research tasks and such, because we've caught 30 Pokemon now, or we've caught 29. We're gonna catch one more and then we'll be doing good, and we'll be doing good. 
Well, hopefully. Who knows how close it'll actually bring us. We're getting very close to the top of this mountain, though. Gotta find one more Pokemon to catch. Oh, look, we're on a tree! I can't believe we haven't run into more Pokemon up here, really. I really... Oh, there's a Geodude. That's such an easy catch. Okay, okay. Let's... Let's just real gently try and... No, did it see us? Oh man. No way. No chance, bro. Dude, we're just gonna go way over here, because they're not gonna see us over there. Now we're just gonna get in the grass, because that's makes sneaking up on them so easy. Get in the ball, Geo dude. Mm-hmm. Bam! All right, that's awesome. Okay, let's head back to camp real quick, and we will just uh, see. Wait, are we in a new region there? Oh, no. Celestica Ruins. Okay, we are. We were in a new region, but uh, let me make sure. Yeah, I think we were, but because of duplicate claws, that Geodude does not count uh, towards our total. So let's see. What have you got for us? 30 Pokemon, yes. Let's report. Look at that, that's glorious. All right, that's so much new stuff. And a lot of new types. Oh man. 16 different types, 11 new entries, backstrike times 12, awesome. Lots of money, we're basically rich. I don't know how Lavington's just carrying this money around with him. Oh, seems like you've made some new observations then. Most illuminating. All right, species newly registered, 20. Oh man. I guess continue my excursion. We are not as close as I thought we were to the next section though. All right, hold on. I'm gonna do some releasing real quick. Um, I wanna see my Pokemon. Let's go ahead and do all this stuff. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What did we, what could we keep? Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. Oh, we can keep this. We could keep, and the Gligar. So let's move you down here and move you down here. Okay, awesome. Everyone else is gone. That's starting with you, Psyduck. Right, yeah, yes, all right. Hold please. Okay, so at the moment, uh, Mercury is level 50 and we did not, we're only like halfway through the research chest, which is a bummer uh, to get to the next level. So we pretty much until, I don't want to level Mercury up again until we get to the, or I don't want to use Mercury again until we get to the um, electrode fight. So for the moment, I'm going to move our um, Ursa Ring onto the team. It is our next strongest Pokemon. We could also consider Owen at 36 or Gligar at 40, which is a flying type. And that's good. Actually, hmm, maybe Gligar would be pretty good against the Electrode because the ground type makes it immune to electric and the flying type makes it strong against grass. Um, yeah, so you really, yeah, maybe, maybe that's the better move. How do you evolve Gligar though? Do you need like a razor? I wonder how you evolve it in this game. At the moment, I'm gonna stick with Earthring, but we need to name both of them. And Ben, Master Namer is not here, so we're gonna look that up real quick. Hold on. Storm. This is after Nolan Storm in the comments. Thank you for watching, Nolan. And let's see, for the Gligar. Man, I am really considering now suddenly. Um, let's see. Dork. I kind of love it. That's after uh, Dork Forge in the comments. Thank you for watching, Dork. Uh, man, that is such a great name. All right, let me know in the towel section down below, who should we bring on, Dork or Storm, until, until we level up and can safely put Mercury back on the team again so that we can rely on Mercury to listen to us. We might have to do both, honestly, because Rotera, Nice, and Luisa are all pressing 50 as well. We have a lot of new faces on this team, possibly. Um, but I think that's where we're gonna call it quits on the day. 30 Pokemon caught, well, how many do we have? Like like 19 Pokemon caught, got Sneasler, had a little boss fight, um, evolved Stone, that was exciting. We caught Storm, really good day 
overall. Uh, next time, hopefully, we'll go fight the Electrode. That should be exciting. Uh, maybe we'll just get up there and we'll just decide to bring Mercury in either way. That'd be cool, too. That'd be cool, too. Uh, otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button if you haven't already, and subscribe so you don't miss any future Nuzlocke episodes from us. But until next time, bye! And before we go, we need to give a huge thank you to all of our supporters over on Patreon. Thank you to Dakota Valentine, Grim 13 Brant Klassen, Dola, Cameron Sherpa, Matt Cox, Robbie Cruz, Sammy San 88 Stacy, Brian Ward, Emerald Phoenix, Lacey Nielsen, Abby Mondin, Afropunk, Aiden Rudinieres, Allison Overcamp, Alyssa White, Andromeda 192, Annika Merton, Aerofell, Becky Borst, Beck Squad, Benjamin Agassi, Brianna Bouchard, Bree Liv, Chris Ray, Jade Culture, Kimberly Lee, Lauren Alexandra, Linwood, Maskmaker, Mops Faruli, Megan Stevens, Moss Twig, Rosalind Goddard, Simon Pertshirt, Tyler Siegel, Vincent Yael, Ez, 0412, Eduardo Bravo, James Buzanel, Joanna Ashcroft, Karen Choi, Luxba92, Monique East, and Stanley Beck. Thank you to all of our supporters over on Patreon. If you'd like to see your name on this list and have your name read out loud, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. Dead spork.